sweetie, what's up? Hey, sweetie. You going to Argus Bazaar? Do you have any information? Sorry, no. But if you're interested, there is a forge there. I used to run it. Impressed? Wow. Yes. If you do pass by, could you bring me the tool bag from inside? Those tools would be a huge help. Say, that's useful information, isn't it? Let me think about it. Where in Argus Bazaar is the forge? Oh, sweetie, you're the best! It's near the high wall, next to the exit of the bazaar. There's only one big forge there. You can't miss it. I'd love to go and visit, but, you know, that wouldn't be a good choice. Leave it to me. Thank you. never seen so many fine tools before. And these blueprints. A starite heater, a magical spinning wheel, an arcane lock. They use starite in every facet of their lives. The only powerful things we make in our city are weapons. Even when Ambari's situation stabilizes in a few years, we'll still have a long way to go before we can catch up with Aphis.
Hey, sweetie, what's up? I found this letter. Oh, Hild, you... You found Myron's letter? You really are good at finding things, aren't you? No need to tell me what it says. I've read it dozens of times. I'm sorry. I thought bringing it back would make you happy. Are you... all right? I... oh, yes, I'm fine. Why wouldn't I be? Listen, Hilda, that letter is from before my sublimation. Not long after martial law was enacted, all the Starite smiths were called on to break down Starite and give the stardust to citizens in need. But... I fear you may misunderstand me based on what's in the letter. I didn't do anything for the cultists or the mob. All I did was help the guards prepare their weapons because they trusted me and needed my skills. What happened afterwards? I couldn't stand those soldiers' attitudes. I'm a person, but they treated me like property. In the end, I refused to help them any further. So, I was given reduced stardust rations, and people started gossiping about me. You must have heard some of the rumors. I felt like I was going to go crazy back then. You understand, don't you, Hild? No, there's no way you could. I got less and less stardust, and the soldiers' abuse became worse and worse. And with the contents of that letter questioning me, I couldn't take it anymore. How could I? So I left, and I threw myself into... I became... Well, you see... This. You were willingly sublimated? Willingly? No, 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 no. I was forced. Forced into all of it. I regret it now. But in the moment... When you can't see a future for yourself, how can you possibly guarantee that you are making the right choice? Here you go. Check it over. Let me see. Mm, everything's here. Great. Oh, sweetie, thank you. I... I'm so happy. Oh, I'm so happy. This one. He left it for me. Oh, I've been waiting so long. Are you crying? Am I? Don't I have a reason to cry? They're back. My beloved tools are back. I... I only shed tears when I'm sad. Tears of joy are the most precious, and only appear after much effort and pain. I'm just so happy. Everything I've been through wasn't all for naught. Thank you, Hilda. I'm glad I could help, Volcane. Oh, let me know if there's anything else, cutie. I should get back to work. <laughs> <laughs>